Hey, what's up guys? It's Corey here, and I am going to be doing kind of like a part two to my train street video. If you guys haven't seen that, make sure you guys check out the, the little icon up here or the link in the description box down below. In that previous video, I was trying to capture the train street as well as the train coming by, but uh, I was just unlucky. The train never came according to the schedule that uh, I saw online. Anyway, that was on the north side of Hanoi Railway Station. I'm now on the south side. There's a different street over here, and uh, let's go check it out. So it's uh, about lunchtime. It's almost 12 o'clock, so everyone is on the lunch break right now, and traffic is a little hectic. So we'll see if uh, we encounter any actual trains. You can see that yellow wall, and there's like a dark green gate. That is the south entrance of the Hanoi Railway Station. And so the train will either be coming in or out of that gate. And right here you can see we're coming up on the railway. Yeah, so this is the tracks here. Not sure exactly what time the train's gonna come if it does, but I'm ready, and I'm gonna hang out until it does. But let's go ahead and uh, walk down the little train street alley over this way, and scope out the scene. Wow, this looks uh, more narrow than the other parts, the northern end. Yeah, still really beautiful though. I'm gonna go very slow so you guys can take it all in. Yeah, so we can see straight there in the distance, that is the Hanora Railway Station. I'm not sure if there's gonna be a northbound or southbound train, but I'm just gonna hang out until uh, a train comes by. <laughs> there needs to be a train in this video. But let's go ahead and check out the south tracks here, the south side of Train Street. So we can see some really beautiful homes and other things along here. It seems more narrow than the north side, definitely. There's a nice curve. Can you see the curve? And oh, look at this old door <laughs> and some uh, like shutter, window shutters right there. Oh, there's a little bunch of kitties. Meow, meow. So I'm just gonna take my time. I'm gonna hang out here as long as I have to until I see that train come through here. That's the mission for today's video, guys. Actual train footage. Oh, there's a little min pin, a miniature pincher. Hi, are you friendly? Huh? Meow, meow. Hi, hi, hi. You okay? Oh, it's all good. Is that where you live? Okay, I'll see you later. I just love all these narrow homes lining both sides of the tracks. Let's cross over. There's just so much going on up here. There's like laundry, electrical wires, architecture, plants, decay, <laughs> all kinds of stuff. Weathering. I like that they put these like shutter boards down along here. It seems like several people are doing that.
daily life in Vietnam, here in Hanoi. She's washing cabbage. And there's a bunch of little um, like outdoor kitchen cookery areas. You can boil water and other things. We got some uh, kumquat trees right there. Poinsettias. see some people chilling over here. I think they're just waiting for the train too. Yeah, this uh, length of the train street is actually much shorter than the other one on the north side. But I kind of actually like this one better. I don't know, it seems like there's more character to this one. I know they both are like pretty awesome, but I don't know. Maybe it's because I haven't been to this side yet. Whoa, check out all these broken. Oh, those are Bia Hoi cups. They're all broken and shattered. Create some home security up there. And then just the back side of these buildings, really beautiful. Look at the, the weathering and the decay on this. Like I know some people think that's just like gross, but to me that's beautiful. That's just so nice. Oh, so cute. <laughs> I love the greenery over here. This is great. Look at this. It's like an amazing garden. Yeah, that is so cool. So I don't really see any food or anything, but I see other businesses like, you know, hair salon. Back there was kind of like a repair shop. And yeah, so it seems like those are the kind of businesses here. This person up here, it looks like they're um, sanding some wood. Uh, neighborhood street. Wow, it looks like a little market down there. Might have to check that out after uh, the train comes. Yeah, so not sure just how far down this goes, but this is pretty much like the beginning of just like the normal road on the side. Like it's not very narrow, you know, people aren't living along the side like right here on the left. back this way you can see just how narrow it gets and then it curves too that's so cool right here is a the little gate that'll come down eventually when the train is gonna come head back up towards the, the northern side of this 
and then I'll post up somewhere and just kind of wait. Hope for that train to pass by. Hmm, nice branding. Railway Outfit Store. I really like this section. That's so cool. I don't see any chickens. Last time in my other video on the northern side, there was a bunch of hens and some roosters and stuff. I haven't seen any over here. Whoa. See that tree and then someone's laundry hanging? There's like the purple pants like way in the middle of the, the alley. Do I hear some ringing? Beeping and ringing? What is that sound? I'm trying to keep an ear open for you know, the warning bell that the train's gonna come. Not sure if what I'm hearing is that or something else. Not sure if you guys can hear it in the video. Okay, so as you can see, I'm, I'm backtracking and almost back to the beginning of uh, this little mini train street over here. Oh, you guys, I think we're in luck. The gate for the Hanoi Railway Station is actually open now. So that means the train's probably gonna come pretty soon. Where should I post up? I gotta find a good spot. I think it's gonna be coming from the south, going northbound. That's just my guess. But I think we're gonna see the train real soon. All right, guys, we can hear the bell over there by the street where all the traffic is. So the gate came down and I can hear the train honking from this way. So it's coming, guys. Get ready. Here it comes. There's a girl standing in the tracks. Get off the tracks. so close I could literally touch it <laughs> and then traffic right back to normal sweet 
Yeah, it went right over those cabbage things over there. They're drying out in the sun. Is it cabbage or mustard greens? I can't tell. So since this uh, little train street here on the south side of the Hanoi Railway Station is just like, a little bit shorter than the north side, I want to add some more um, like value to this video for you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and do kind of like a loop around the block. And so there's some alleys here that we saw earlier um, in the video. And I'm going to go down there. It looks like there's some markets and stuff. So we'll just check out the local neighborhood and then uh, I'll end the video. Yeah, so I'm back here at this uh, crossing. And then this is the alley that we saw earlier. And we're gonna go check this out and just kind of see what the local Vietnamese neighborhood is like back here. It's nice and shady, which is great. Eggs. There's some uh, pork over there. It might be kind of um, disturbing for many to see just raw meat out like this, unrefrigerated, but this is how they do it in Vietnam. And I buy my meat like that here, and I've never been sick. You know, if it looks bad or smells bad, I definitely don't buy it, but um, a lot of this stuff's pretty fresh. Roses. Different fruits. I know I say this a lot in my videos about Hanoi, about like the reason why I like it, and it's just this old vibe, the old architecture and the, yeah, just everything. Look at this, it's just so cool. There are some alleys down there. I'm gonna go back this way. This is going north towards the train station. Wow, look at all these plants on people's balconies, really nice. This is cool, I'm gonna have to come back here because my house is not too far from here. I didn't know this was uh, all back up in here. such a beautiful day. It's sunny and check out this tree growing all over the side of the buildings. The like purple pink flowers blooming. Very cool. And I love that people just hang their clothes to dry right on the electrical wires. a lot of street food back here too. Looks like bun cha. Yep. Grilled pork patties with uh, bun, the rice noodles. Unfortunately, I'm not hungry. <laughs> I ate before I came out here, so I'm actually still kind of full. But I will come by here and uh, check out some stuff and maybe make a proper food video. Um, for you guys. Ooh, it's bundao. I like that.
Wow. I'm glad I found this alley. Just look at how high this is. So many apartments. Here's Pangkwang. Yummy. It's pretty narrow between these buildings here, you can see. But we've seen narrower in previous Vietnam walk videos. Some of the buildings were almost touching. And it looks like right here, we're back out to the main road. All right guys, that's it for this uh, walking video of the train street plus the little market, a uh, little alley here uh, connected to the train street. So if you guys are ever coming down this area, make sure you check my info box, the description box down below. I'm gonna have a Google short link for you guys uh, with a map to this location. So if you guys are wanting to come here yourself, all that info is down below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in some future videos here in Hanoi. Bye!